spirit renewed 888 nightly inspiration this giddy <laughs> sorry I shouldn't be coughing y'all know it's COVID uh, but uh so I want to make a video to um basically um explain to you guys what I do um I basically have been prophetic from a young age I had this obsession with Jesus and um, his sacrifice I used to wake up crying in the middle of the night um, praying like dang I should have helped him carry that cross you know what I'm saying um, and even now I, I hold this sacred heart I got a tattoo on my chest um, so all this is to say as I got older, um, I've gotten into this mystic, um, spiritual um, type of um, influencing. Um, something that came just natural from my own pain and trials. Um, I never, it was easy for me to get over my pain and trials, however they were pain and trials. Um, but at the same time, there was such a blessing because I was able to grow. Um, I, I, at this point, being a spirit medium, I started going to various establishments and running into people. And then if um, you look up and to the right, I would get these voices or these images. Um, and then, um, so it'd be either someone's grandmother, someone's mother, and then they would tell me rather, you know, what to say. I mean, it's always up, like my third eye and to the right. Um, and then I would hear these voices or something like these absent voices. And then I would have to relay them to whomever I would just run into. Not, no clients. I would just run into people. Um, and at this point, I got on this my own journey of like um, spiritual healing and frequency healing. You know what I'm saying? And it took me, got me to this point of healing that is so beautiful like and um so i wanted to share the world share it to the world and